it's Katie and for today's video I'm going to be going to the park spending kind of a little like date by myself enjoying nature enjoying time to myself embracing that time to myself all right I think I decided what I'm gonna wear I'm gonna wear these pants they're kind of loose and comfortable I think they'll be good for doing some yoga at the park and then this top and then I'm also gonna be wearing my selenite necklace and my chakra bracelet got my lunch that I packed I have all of my journals and my book in my backpack sunscreen of course and then I also brought my penny board so that I can get a little bit of skating in and then I also wanted to do some yoga journal a bit maybe read my book um, I'm definitely gonna be sharing some journaling prompts and some affirmations with you guys later and other than that I kind of just want to enjoy time to myself and just be present and really just kind of connect to myself a little more Right, so I'm super hungry, so I'm about to eat lunch. I brought a turkey wrap that I got from Target yesterday. Brought some jalapeno chips. These are the Aldi, Aldi version of them. And I'm gonna try them to see if they're better because they're only $1.50 versus like $4 a bag. We got some veggies. I got some bell peppers, some cucumbers at the bottom, and some rainbow baby carrots, some red bell pepper hummus, watermelon, a chia squeeze for later if I get hungry, the rest of my kombucha from yesterday, and then these I've been obsessed with. These are these are like chocolate coated espresso beans, and they're seriously so good, you guys. I am a little sad because I forgot my mic, so with the wind, some of these clips might be really like quiet, but we're gonna see. It rained last night and it sounds like it's gonna rain again. I kind of hope it does because it's making it nice and cool out here. Like I didn't even have to find shade, which was really nice. It's starting to sprinkle. Shoot, I haven't even gotten to like journal or nothing yet, but I really just wanted to come out here because it's starting to become really important to me to like put effort into spending time by myself and like value my time as much as I would another person's and value my company as much as I would another person. I've been learning like I can still go do fun things even if it's like just me going and that's okay and sometimes that's even better and that's what I need and I really do feel that taking yourself on a little self-love date is super important and that's kind of what this is for me. Hopefully it doesn't rain too hard and I can enjoy the weather out here because honestly it is so beautiful. I feel so alive, so grounded, just so grateful to be here with myself right now. <laughs>
as I journal. My first one is what things help me fully enjoy time to myself. I think this one's really good for like pinpointing which activities that you enjoy doing alone and allows you to kind of bring those things in as you see it written down on paper. I think they're gonna start, oh wait, All right, we move. We're walking to a new location where they've already mowed the grass. But the journaling prompt I was gonna share with you guys before we were interrupted was, is there anything that I have learned about myself from spending time alone? And I would say I've learned quite a bit from spending time alone. I've learned for sure that I can do a lot of things that I didn't think I could do by myself. I've learned that I love spending time in nature versus like being in a city. I'd rather like be in nature, be in the fresh air. And then the last journal prompt I wanted to share with you guys from today is, are there any beliefs that I hold that may stop me from embracing time alone? And for me, that I guess I'm not worthy of taking myself places that I would normally go with other people. Um, kind of like today, like this is not something I normally do. It's something I am trying to um, bring into my life and be intentional about. But normally I would probably invite someone else with me or um, go do something else by myself that uh, wasn't as like thoughtful or planned out. And I think it's nice for me to give myself that same respect, like planning something fun to do, even if it's just going to be me, instead of being like, oh, well, it's just going to be me. I don't have to put any effort into, you know, planning something to do today when I think it can be really meaningful for you to plan little dates for yourself and make it intentional and make it something that you're committed to and, and want to go to. And I would say that I guess I used to believe that somehow my t it kind of almost felt to me like I was believing that my time was less valuable than another person's, which absolutely isn't true. Your time and energy is just as valuable as anyone else's, and you deserve to do something for yourself with your time that makes you truly feel present, helps you enjoy your life, helps you love yourself and enjoy time with yourself and see that a hangout with yourself can be just as valuable as a hangout with another person. Now I want to go ahead and read you guys some affirmations. So my first affirmation of the day is I value my own time and company. Another one I wrote here is I embrace my time alone and use it to learn more about myself. And the last one that I wrote today is, I am worthy of showing myself love and taking intentional time for myself. And I really feel that all of these really just help remind me that I am worthy of taking time for myself. I am worthy of enjoying my own company. I am
came out here to kind of spend this time with myself, take myself on this little park date. I also think another thing to remember when spending time by yourself is that you need to have a support system within yourself as well as within other people. So that way you know that you can count on yourself, you know that you're there to support you no matter what happens, no matter who's around. And I think that can be really refreshing and empowering. It can let you know that you can take care of yourself and you can be there for yourself. And to add on to what I was saying, that definitely doesn't mean that you don't need a support system of other people as well. That's definitely very, very important and has even been shown that like having people around you and having like good loving relationships can actually lead to a longer life. So that's definitely an important one too, but I do think that another important thing is to have that inside, that internal support system so that you have that reassurance kind of that no matter what happens, you're gonna be okay. Everything that is happening is something that you can handle and you can truly feel into that. I feel like I want that support for myself to be even. Like I want to be able to be there for myself and comfort myself and honestly just be someone that I enjoy spending time with. So that's why I think these little self-love dates are super important. I really believe that they've help, been helping me learn a lot more about myself every time as I sit and I reflect. And honestly, it's so rewarding and I definitely recommend it to any of you guys. I also feel like it's it kind of showing myself that I can show up for myself and I can follow through for myself as I schedule this time and then I go and actually complete it, then I feel as though I am just as important as any other, like anything else that I would schedule time for, like going to work or hanging out with a friend. So I think that is really important and also a key part and kind of just shows you like you are worthy of giving yourself this time and you are worthy on following through on the things that you want to do and you are worthy of using your time to do the things you want to do. So I think that is all for my little rant for the day. I'm gonna go ahead and head home. I think this may be the end of the vlog. Um, if you guys did enjoy, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below before you leave for more weekly content. As usual, I hope you guys have a beautiful, productive day and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!